I'm back. But like I was saying, they are able to maneuver in the brains of any electronics. But like I was saying about the carbon dioxide, I put a detector down because I thought it was a camera in there and a maneuver and everything. But no camera in there because they working off the brain. Anyhow, I left the wires hanging from the attachment of the carbon dioxide. Like I said, I was getting out the shower last night. Why would I say I got the shower and stood in the hallway for just a hot second? It shocked me. So they sending shock through wireless plugs, wireless with brains. Uh, they able to shock you, maneuver it, see in, see within your house through these wires, through your carbon dioxide, through your, um, um, your um, uh, fire detective detector they are able to maneuver in these they able to maneuver in your light bulbs i don't know if anybody have came aware but like i said i have became awakened and they able to send things from light bulbs from your light fixtures on your ceiling they able to send particles down into your food into your drinks into your bed into your um uh, on your floor so when you get in the bed you and you don't really brush off your feet for real you get in the bed and it start with you i mean this is how bad this shit is being maneuvered on their um with the electronic i mean uh yeah with the electronics they have that's the tablets the supercomputer the because I don't really believe they have equipment like that. I believe that they are maneuvering off tablets. Because the girl who house it is, they next door, her dude are selling government phones. Well, giving away government phones. And by him giving away government phones. And that, that's another thing, too. These people who is giving us government phones, don't trust them so much. I'd rather for you to go through the, the website of the uh, customer service because these people are maneuvering and hacking into your body from social security cards to IP addresses to your telephone number. So this is being maneuvered really easy and quickly without you being aware of the situation. So we have to have our eyes open and the things that they are doing around us is happening to everybody, but some is not awakened. Some is not awakened yet. So they can sit and watch you for months until they send that signal pick up your brain and then you attached. We got to understand and see, like I said, I didn't know nothing about this, but I knew we had a little electricity in our brain, but not knowing that it was able to be hacked by some low life ass peoples. These ain't the government. It's the government that did it because I feel like, I mean, it's the government. It's the military. Somebody in the military did this. It's somebody in the military that all our targeters that know somebody is either the people that know somebody in the military or is people is somebody in the military. So it still all falls back on the military basis because the government is still not aware how to catch their predators. If you if they look at so many people on this damn American most wanted. How in the hell they can't find them if they using technology like this? If you can find, if you got technology to direct in somebody's head or their phone or their house or their body, then why the fuck they can't find these peoples that's out here doing bad crime? See, they said this is from what I heard. They said they gonna have, they gonna be able to hack into people's brains that's thinking of criminal doing criminal criminal activities and they're able to stop it what type of shit is that i mean really how do how would you even know if somebody is thinking of doing something how do you know you what they just pick motherfuckers out no it ain't just that simple i don't understand how it's that simple but everybody can be hacked it ain't nobody that can be hacked if they send a direct um direct uh, uh electronic uh hack uh, electronic magnet feels to your head you're gonna be that you they're targeting you 
you are the target. Like they, like my neighbors did. They knew I sat in front of the TV. I have a drink at night, you know. But at that time, I was able to go to sleep. But when I came aware to this, I knew somebody was watching me. I knew it. I knew it. I just couldn't do figure out what was going on, but I knew I was being watched. I don't know if, and like I said, I only been a victim for seven months, but <clears throat> just the thought that somebody able to hack into your phone, zoom in from your TV, and you don't have a smart TV with a camera, but they are in your system. Because that's really how I found out about this. Because, like I said, I knew somebody was watching me. But I couldn't understand what was going on around me. But at the same time, when I seen that camera, when I seen them zoom in at carbon dioxide detective, that was good enough for me. I knew I wasn't tripping. I knew I wasn't tripping. I knew that something was going on badly around me. And then happened after that incident, I end up happening to hear them talking through a TV that's not plugged. Straight talking from the speaker in the back of the TV. It's no camera on this motherfucking TV. This not a smart TV. This is a TV they was talking through. I put this TV on the bed without plugged up and they still was able to talk through my TV. If that ain't no bad shit that a motherfucker that's just able to just do. Because these people are low lives. They ain't got nothing else better to do. Their life was already fucked up from the beginning before they even hacked into yours. Like my neighbors, they they is some miserable ass people. They cannot sit and jam together by themselves. They got to have a crowd around them. We don't have to have a crowd. It, I don't have to maneuver like that to enjoy myself, to enjoy my kids or enjoy the company that I have. But these young people, because what she like 27, he like 32. So with that being said, these are young people that with no lives. But I guess what gives me is that this motherfucker is still able to work with the government phones and he is harassing people. And not only that, we don't have no internet and no Wi-Fi in our house, but our phone. But it's a little too late for that because they in my walls. <laughs> they in my surroundings. They in my vehicle. They maneuvering my vehicle. They are stopping my vehicle. They're um, um, messing with um, unloosing things in my vehicle. This is just they maneuvering from wires on my seat. So we, we know that they out here doing weird, crazy shit that we never thought of. Because yeah, it's weird. How you can maneuver, how you can maneuver with bed springs. They bother you more because they able to maneuver off your bed springs. This is what I'm saying. We got to understand what's going on around us. Like I said, I only been in this program. I mean, not in this program. I only been uh, harassed for seven months for now. So, <clears throat> um, I am really trying to, um, I kind of, I really want people to go on my page and sign my petition. Let's get this out here. I need more subscribers. I need more people to stand up. I need more people. If you see in this video, video, like it, like it, post it on your Facebook page, everything. We need to spread the word. Let's spread it, spread it, spread it, spread it, spread it to get all the way to the center. Let's spread it because if all of us stand, we all can make a difference. These people are predators. They have no life. They're ha they have families, which they don't give a fuck. This is how their lives is so destroyed within their self that they don't have much. That they getting their energy from us. <laughs> they getting their energy from us because my energy don't never fade. I'm still going to be who I am. I'm going to rock who I am. I'm going to stay cussing them out. I'm going to stay um, drinking until I can sleep good at night. I'm going to stay being myself. Yes, I have to drink myself to sleep. Ain't no way a person should have to drink themselves to sleep. I never had to do it at first. All of a sudden, now I can't take, lay down and take a nap. 
I can't even close my eyes without still being harassed in my head by my neighbors. I mean, it's real ridiculous. And I don't even have to be here for me not to hear them because they in my eye. They maneuvering like a camera in my eye. Like last night, um, I don't know if they was trying to make me go cross at it or make me look somewhere I really wasn't trying to look. And they kept bothering my my left eye. I feel like my left eye is dealing with their camera. And this is sad because I feel like they always in your body. When they when they even got a hold to your eye like that, they always in your body. Maneuvering, <clears throat> harassing, sexual harassment. Um but like I said, it's no bother to me because the technology that they use, that shit don't bother. That shit is not hurt me. Like, yeah, we've been sexual harassed, but we've been being sexual harassed individually, but it's not really uh, being harmed to our body. Because I, I, I still got that good. I still got that good. <laughs> I still got good. So what they, they doing is not really, you know, uh, it's like... Um, 